this is the start of my solar uh, hot water solar hydronic heating system um, I'm going to kick it off on the ground maybe heat the pool or do some preliminary tests and move it onto the house if I have good results um, I mentioned this before but I have a a uh, old computer rack that I'm going to line with wood uses a tank I've got a pump sitting over here the Taco 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 pump not sure how to pronounce that um, it's a little dirty it's used I don't really care but I framed up this box and put it back on it and what I did is I cut a lip in the 2x4 and as a test I'm actually using this to keep the stair in place but you can see the lip that was my test so I did the same thing on this and I countersank not only the wood but a uh, see if I can set this down piece of insulation in here uh, so that's all going to be painted black some of the insulation the reflective coating is coming up I'm not worried about that because my uh, my absorber fins are going to keep that um, down I'm going to have copper pipe running around in here and here's a sample of an absorber plate for a half inch um, pipe so you're going to have pipes coming around going across from side to side all the way across and then this will be screwed down to that backer board I showed you a minute ago and then on top of all that I'm going to have this sheet of polycarbonate right here it's triple wall got it from a greenhouse supply company that thing fell over in my grass when I had it outside it was a sunny day it was down for I'm guessing 20 minutes a half hour and got a big old dead spot on my grass so I definitely know it's uh, it's pretty intense and keeps the the heat in um, I don't know if it's as efficient as a piece of uh, glass specified to to reflect rays only you know one way and absorb them the other um, I'm thinking it might be the same concept just a, a little lighter don't know if you can see the three walls there one on the outsides one in the middle that'll make it um, you know a better R value better insulated uh, it's light for an 8 4 by 8 I could pick this thing up no problem um, I could have got it bigger I got it cut to the size of a 4 by 8 I had 8 uh, foot studs um, you know that is one of common materials but the studs ended up being way out of true and uh, when I bought them they weren't but they've been sitting on my front um, deck for a while and because of that they warped unfortunately the way I'm going to keep that polycarbonate down I got some J channel here see, so you can see the the profile it's going to slip in there and then this is going to kind of go around the perimeter of the box a uh, buddy of mine started building a solar pool heater and uh, I've had these parts sitting around for about a half a year and it kind of inspired me to uh, begin my project again and move forward um, anyway I'll have an update soon thanks for watching here's an idea of what the uh, box is going to look like um, I just have it laid on there rough I gotta cut up some metal yet make the edges and corners fit up nice um, that's just sitting on top just so you can get an idea the rest of that is actually polycarbonate is in that J channel um, kinda gives you an idea where I'm going that's not going to be silver when I'm done it's all going to be painted with uh, stove paint high temperature stove paint I got some fittings coming in the mail um, and I'm gonna go shopping for some uh, copper pipes here probably this week I'm in no hurry I mean it's taken me a half year to get this far so I'm just gonna take my time now my buddy 
I think he fiberglassed his box, which isn't a bad idea. Thinking about doing that. Or I'll just paint it with exterior paint like I did with my uh, solar air heater. But I uh, just want to provide a little update and snapshot of what it's going to look like. Alright then.